My TV 53 News at 8.30 is digging deeper right now. Hi, everybody. Welcome to My TV 53 News at 8.30. On Tuesdays and Thursdays, we dig deeper with some of the biggest newsmakers in Fresno and beyond. But tonight, we are talking about the city of Fresno. We have a very exciting vendor fair happening this coming weekend. And Christine Matos is with me. How you doing? Welcome. I'm fabulous, Austin. Thank you for asking. How are you? Doing good, doing good. 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 We have a big event happening yes. in just a few days, just a few hours from now. And this is a, a very exciting community event where you are working with businesses mm -hmm. and nonprofits. Mm -hmm. And uh, and then my TV 53 will be out there this weekend. Yes, so yes. let's talk all about it. Let's, let's. So this Saturday, um, September 30th, in the corner of Herndon and West, we are going to have a community event um, from 1 to 5 p.m. We have about 30 vendors, small businesses coming and we also have Valley Animal um, Shelter coming out, or the center, I should say, coming out and hopefully bringing some pups or pets to adopt. And that would be awesome for us to be able to collaborate with them and bring some support to them. So make sure you come on over to Hernan and West this Saturday at one o'clock. So uh, tell me a little bit about uh, kind of update us because you've been doing a lot of vendor fairs just in uh, in the last, yeah. well, during the summer even. Yeah. 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 So I did take a little bit of time off over the summertime just because Fresno weather is mm -hmm. hot. Yeah. But still working behind the scenes. Fall season is here. And I want to say for probably most hosts and vendors, it's the best time of year. Right because we're changing to the holidays, a lot of different themes. Um, the products that people make will be such as that. You know, we have Christmas shopping to do. Yep. Why not do it with right. us small businesses? And there's a lot of talent out there. And like I said, there's at least 30, maybe 31 vendors coming this Saturday, all very unique, but very talented. And we're gonna have food and drinks and treats and anything you can think of we're gonna have. I want to talk a little bit and uh, about uh, the future because you have a lot yes, coming up. Yes, the so. future is good, Austin. What do you have? So what November twenty fifth. Okay. Let me just show. You're going to start seeing this flyer circulating. It's after Thanksgiving Black Saturday, so we have our Black Friday, but we're going to do it on a Saturday, and this is an opportunity for the businesses whether they want to get rid of some of the holiday stuff okay. or prepare for Christmas shopping. It'll be a great opportunity for them to do that. And we're going to do it right outside the studios on this date, November 25th, same time, 1 to 5 p.m. And then leading into December the 30th, right before New Year's. Okay. So after Christmas, people are still shopping around for Christmas gifts. But this is an opportunity once again. What happens in the vendor world, um, we make a lot of product for the season. Mm -hmm. So let's downsize the product that we have and get ready for 2024. So this is going to be a great opportunity. It's to bring in the New Year's. It's our winter uh, party out here, uh, one to five once again. So you're all invited. So make sure you follow myself on Facebook. I share a lot of information with Austin. And then what's this? This is so, Halloween because Halloween yes. is coming up. Yes. So new to mm -hmm. Tasty Treats, I'm collaborating um, with Mona. She's from Healing Bath and Body Solutions. Okay. We created what's called the Herndon Trail. It's almost kind of like when you're going wine tasting, yeah. you want a wine map of the wineries. Right. Well, we're occupying all of Herndon pretty much is what we're trying to do. So we have Herndon and Milburn. We have an event, um, Herndon and Brawley, which is near the TNT collectibles on okay. the Garden Loop okay. and also the Chevron on Herndon and Brawley as well. And then leading to the Fresno Commons once right, again. Right. So we have four different locations up and down Herndon right now for any vendor that wants to join us. This is a map. I share it on my social media. So cool. does Mona. Okay, perfect. And then down here for November, December, you see we have several events coming up. So this is just a way to simplify if you want to be a vendor, mm -hmm. where am I going to go? Right. We give you opportunities to grow your business yeah. and just be part of the community. So that's what this is about. So that just kind of shows that October 7th, so not this Saturday, mm -hmm. but the following Saturday, we'll be at Herndon and Milburn. 
Herndon so and Milburn. Taco okay. Loco is right there. Um, it's oh, where yeah. the okay. Okay. community health care center is. It mm-hmm. used to be the Boz Allergy Building. Right. Right, right across from the Save Mark Grocery uh, Store. So we're going to start doing monthly ones there as well, alternating awesome. between this location and that location. Once again, just bringing the community together. Very fun. Opportunity for everybody. What's going on with uh, Tasty Treats by Chris? So Tasty Treats by Chris is still vending. I'm still a vendor. I still mm-hmm. have my products. Um, just something new for this season. I'm, I brought you some, too, and I didn't give it to you yet. I'm going to start freezing 32-ounce I'm, I'm, I'm gonna. Jugs. I'm going to walk over here. So it's on the front counter, <laughs> the other counter. Oh, okay. Yep. Okay. So I'm going to start freezing the 32-ounce lemonades. And people can buy it and take it home. Oh, sweet. So I brought you a blueberry one with Ooh, cups oh, and yes. straws. What? Oh, my gosh. Awesome. So I'm just going to start freezing it and selling it. It's pretty popular Heck at my yeah. events. Um, selling lemonade. Wait, you know, is what, what flavor is this? Blueberry. Oh, that's blueberry. So when blueberry. you take it out, oh my all gosh. the blueberries on the bottom, just yes. be careful. You might. Yeah, I don't want to yeah. get it all over the studio. <laughs> But wow, awesome. Thank yeah, you. That's for Thank you. you. But Tasty Treats is still doing what she needs to do. Um, like I said, I took the summer off. It's just too hot to bake. Yeah. Um, I do have my all natural pet treats. Um, oh, that's, that's right. I want to talk about new. that. Yeah, yeah. That's new. And that's she even been, said that I could try them. He could, you can eat them. <laughs> the thing about the pet treats, six ingredients, all natural. Okay. I've tasted it. My daughter had tried it with me. It's not our go to snack. Mm-hmm. But we wanted to taste the product that I was right. creating. Yeah. So we have oats, pumpkin, peanut butter, okay. cinnamon, eggs, and coconut oil all baked together. Different sizes for your pets. Um, it's very soft. So even like your senior dogs can eat them because, yeah. you know, I have a Frenchie's really small teeth. Okay. They have no problem. No problem. So that's yeah. been very popular. Like I said, Valley Animal Center, I've been working with them. Even Fresno Humane, I've been working with them too. And I've donated, you know, dog treats to them because awesome. there's so many yeah. that need fostering or adoption. So it's crazy anything right that now. I could do yeah. to help. Uh, phone number, how can people get in touch about this Saturday or uh, the other events? So follow me on Facebook under Christine Matos. Um, if not, you can always call or text me at 559-612-8079. All right, very good. Hope to see you this weekend, everybody. I'm Austin Reed. That's Christine Matos, and you're watching My TV 53 News at 830. Stay with us. Bye, everybody. See you Saturday. This is My TV 53 News. Hello, I'm Austin Reed. Thank you for watching this latest YouTube video. If you haven't done so yet, make sure you subscribe to the My TV 53 YouTube channel and be sure to watch the Valley's only primetime news at 8, weeknights from 8 to 9 p.m., only on My TV 53. You can also catch us anytime on the local B TV app.